Jamila Aman grew up in Eritrea, East Africa. In 1977, her family went to Sudan as refugees to escape the conflict between Eritrea and Ethiopia. It was 1984 when Jamila, still a teenager, and her sister came to London, Ontario to go to school. Uh, so when we came to Canada, it was very difficult for me and my sister Nora uh, to survive. First of all, being a government-sponsored uh, uh, immigrant, it's a very limited budget, and we were quite scared how to balance the books and you know, be able to pay for expenses. Jamila knew she had to find a job to survive. Through one of her classmates, she found her first Canadian job. I said, what kind of a job? And he says, worm picking. It took me a while to understand what worm picking is. Even he drew worm for me. Jamila learned a valuable lesson from that job, never give up. Since coming to Canada, Jamila's obtained a degree in business administration and her ESL teacher certification. She's also a graduate of the Executive Directors Institute at the Schulich School of Business, and she is currently pursuing her master's degree. Jamila has been Executive Director of Northwood Neighborhood Services for over 14 years. When I first became acting ED, Northwood budget was 280,000, and uh, we had five employees, and none of the five uh, employees were full-time. We had, uh, you know, child care workers and, um, that only worked like few hours a week. And today, I can tell you, we have uh, 28 you know, employees and we have casual workers and uh, the organization has grown uh, to be citywide, national and international organization. Jamila constantly looks for ways to build viability and sustainability for Northwood. This grassroots agency is now a major community hub of activity and visibility providing programs, services, and sanctuary for new immigrants. Jamila has a passionate commitment to helping people and cares deeply about the community. Actually, I was a founding member of the Canadian African Businesswomen's Alliance. I was the membership chair. Um, I also served on the board of OCASI for two years. Um, and I served on the uh, advisory committee of Humber College, the school of Salman, you know, the advisory committee for the Salman program. Um, I also served on the United Way Membership Committee and in 2006 I served on the Cabinet of United Way as well as the uh, uh, CCR, the Canadian Council for Refugees. I was the treasurer uh, on the board and currently I'm a board member for the Learning Disability Association as well as uh, Humber College the School of Social Work. Being involved in different not-for-profit organizations within the community has been uh, an enormous source of um, inspiration and also has been a source of success. Not something that was planned, but something that happened. So it only made sense for us that if, if this formula seems to, to work, that we should celebrate people who have adopted that path and who have done it really well, such as in the case of Jamila. I would say my greatest accomplishment is being able to create an environment where newcomers are able to get help, uh, helping them to help themselves. This is, I will say, this is my greatest accomplishment. The 2009 recipient of the New Pioneers Award for Community Service is Jamila Aman.